Hi everyone, welcome to Master Chef Mom. Today I'm going to share a very special and tasty dish. It is the Nellai Kutanjur. So I want to say some special things about this uh, iconic dish. Nellai Kutanjur, Nellai in the dish means Tirunelveli. So this dish is basically from the Tirunelveli district of Tamil Nadu. It is actually considered as a picnic dish because lot of vegetables are added and it is a one pot rice wholesome lunch which you can make. Also kutan in the kutan joru means mix. Lot of vegetables are mixed together and the best part these vegetables are the local and seasonal vegetables that you get like brinjal, drumstick, different pumpkins, the yellow and the white pumpkin, raw banana, all these are used. And chore means rice. So this is a mix of vegetable and rice, a one pot wholesome dish that your entire family will enjoy. So for Kutan Zoru, first we have to chop and get all our vegetables ready. Once it is ready, we will soak the rice and dal and keep it aside. Then for the spices, grinding spices, we will fry ingredients like shallot, garlic, red chilli, green chilli and grind a fresh masala. Once the masala is ready, we'll start making the kutan zore. Okay, one pot vessel. And then we are going to add all the vegetables, rice, and cook the kutan zore. So I'm adding the tuar dal along with rice. We're going to wash this nicely and soak it. I've also soaked tamarind in hot water. Nalennai, sesame oil, pundu, garlic, shallots, sambar vengayam, dry red chilies, kanjamolaga. Karo taste ke the body adjust panikanga. Add spice according to your taste. Ipo I'm going to add coconut. Tenga add pani 2 3 minutes la gas switch off panila. The coconut did not fry too much, you can switch it off after 2 minutes. Once this cools down, we'll grind it into a paste. Sesame oil, malanne. Onion, avaraka, lima beans, murunka, drumstick, manja pushnika, yellow pumpkin, vella pushnika, feta, white pumpkin, tomato, tomato is optional. If you have raw mango, you can also add raw mango with the skin you can add. That will also give a nice tangy taste. Brinjal, I am using the small variety brinjal for this. Varaka, raw banana. Turmeric powder, rock salt, I am going to add some water and let the vegetables cook. The vegetables are cooked beautifully. Now I am going to add the ground masala. Now I'm going to extract juice from the tamarind and I'm going to add it to the pot. I'm adding some karvepla curry leaves for flavor. And now we are going to add the soaked rice and dal mixture. Add water and then we are going to cover and cook it. We are going to check if it's done. Beautiful. Our kutan jor is now ready. We are now going to temper the kutan jor. Nalanai, sesame oil, kadugu, I am adding mustard seeds. We are adding curry leaves, asafoetida, that is uh, perengayam. We are also going to add some sambar vengayam, shallots. I slow cooked Kutanjur today and it came out so beautifully. Raghu, taste how is it? It's Too good. I'm just loving all the vegetables. I mean, for people who love vegetables, no? This is like heaven. Correct. Mm. And you saw 
how easy it was to make it also do try it out and share your feedback with me i'll see you soon with another delicious recipe till then happy cooking my favorite brinjal no?